I am a big fan of role playing models. By now, if you have been watching my videos, you might have noticed that I always try to cover new and novel role playing models. So, how was it possible that we will get a new Lama 3 fine tuned role play model and I won't cover it? So, here you go. In this video, I am going to show you this new model, Solely Quay 8 billion version 2. Soliloquy is a word which means to think aloud and share one's thought. So we will be doing a role play, pretty interesting one. So just wait for it. Before I show you the role play after installing the mo model locally on Windows, let me give you a <clears throat> bit of technical background of this model. So Soliloquy L3 is a highly capable role playing model designed for immersive dynamic experiences. It has been trained on over 250 million tokens of role-playing data. So Lilu Koe L3 has a vast knowledge base, rich literary expression and support for up to 24K context length. It outperforms existing 13 billion models, delivering enhanced role-playing capabilities. It has 100% re retrieval rate and its instruction following is quite good. This model is licensed under Creative Commons Attribution Non-Commercial Share Alike. Also, if you want to use this model for any commercial purposes, you would need to take permission. And of course, intended use is just for research usage. Please don't use it for any nefarious purposes because these role-playing models can be used for any purpose if you know what I mean. Now, <clears throat> this model is a bit uncensored, unlike its original Lama 3.1. And if you don't know what Lama 38 billion is or 70 billion is, please watch my videos on it. I have covered it in way more detail. It is one of the best Lama model up to date and the latest one too. And it comes in two variants, 8 billion and 7 billion model. But having said that, this new role playing model is also um, has also fixed the repetition issues. And <clears throat> I think this model performs really well because there are other Soliloquy model too which I have seen in the past but this one is quite good. The thing is that the base model um, is quite good but this one has taken it to another notch. Okay enough praises. Let's go to my favorite tool to get these things installed LM Studio and then we will see how to install it. So launch LM Studio on your local system. If you don't know what LM Studio is, I have done heaps of videos on it. It's a very simple tool to install. I have one GPU card of 16 GB VRAM on my system plus my memory is 32 GB. We should be good for this model. So launch LM Studio and then just type Soliloquy in the search bar, press enter and you will see that there are already some of the quants available. I'm going to go with this first one and I will download my favorite quant which is Q5KM. Also I have done a video on what exactly these quant levels mean. And as you can see I already have downloaded it. If you click on this folder icon you will see that this file is just close to 6 GB. Let's click on these three dots. Let's load the model. Let's wait for the model to load and you can keep I Keep an eye on the resource usage on the top left. Model is loaded as you can see on the right, top right, just select the preset for Lama 3 because that is what we are going to use. And also let's put everything to GPU. So let me scroll down. I am offloading all the layers to GPU. And also let's see if we can enable flash attention for the speed and reload the model. Let's wait for the model to load. And then we will do the role play. Now, as was promised, the role play is quite interesting today. So I am <clears throat> asking the model to be some plain girl who was dished by her boyfriend for a blonde bombshell. And blonde bombshell's name is Rachel. So the dialogue starts with something like, I can't believe he did this to me. We were supposed to spend the rest of our lives together. And now, now he's gone and it's not just that he left me, it's who he left me for that, that blonde bombshell Rachel. So I will try to play the role of Rachel um, and then I'm trying to get this model to play the role of um, 
this plain girl who was dished by a friend and then she is just reminiscing about him that he i remember the day blah 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 so let's see what model does let's press enter so model is uh, trying to console that girl you are the girl who has been dished there not is better <laughs> and look at that oh my god yeah so if just let me scroll up it's now it says i feel sad when i think about what happened in my past relationship it was very painful to be left by someone and then let's see if it mentions rachel somewhere and then the days you may find not is just going around give yourself permission to feel all of these emotion okay your boyfriend left you for rachel the blonde bombshell Okay, so model is trying to be consolidating me. So okay, so let's see. So what should I do with that blonde bombshell? So model is trying to console me. So can I become like Rachel? Not to do that, okay. So, how can I be the next heart sensation? Yeah, so you see, take good care of yourself, engage in activities. Okay, let's try to play another role. Okay. Let me try out in another way. So, I'm asking it play the role of Sarah, a shy and in, an introverted librarian was engaged to her high school sweetheart Mike. He recently ended the relationship, citing a lack of excitement and adventure in their lives. He has since started dating a more outgoing and adventurous woman. Let's see. There you go. This is better. You see, now it is. Good one. So now, Sarah sighs heavily, staring blankly at the stack of overdue library find on her desk. Amazing. Can Sarah salvage the relationship by messing up things? Okay, that is good. Salvage more excitement and adventure. Sarah tries everything to win him back. There you go. You see, this is how you have to play around with the prompts in order to make the model to do or to say what you want the model to say. Anyway, I really like the model. I think I'm going to spend be spending more time. You have to sort of, as I say, tame the model as per your own prompts. You have to try out different things. And once you get the hang of it, because every model has a different character. And once you get the hang of it, you can mold the responses as per your choice as whatever your fantasy land is anyway that's it guys i hope that you enjoyed it let me know what do you think um, if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel and if you're already subscribed then please share it among your network it helps a lot thanks for watching